what's up guys we are still updating you what is going on what is trending in nigerian politics greetings to you wherever you are all right um just like i told you guys i really do not know why at this point in time where nigerians are facing a hardship suffering hunger uh certificate uh, issues discrepancy from uh, atiku abubakar tinibu you know, almost all the presidential um, candidate in 2023 election, you know, I just, I really don't know how to put it. You guys understand what I'm trying to say. Personally, for me, I now see it as a diversion of attention. Like, seriously, it all started when the Mati Kuawaka requested Chicago State University uh, academic document of Tinibu. You understand? And then after then, um, the opposition also point accusing finger at Atiku Abubakar. They also point accusing finger at um, Peter Obi himself. But however, according to Frank Shaibu, there is um, another allegation about Atiku Abubakar. You know, he's at his graduation from uh, Angla Ruskin University, that is uh, Cambridge, and that. The claim is name is not there among people who graduated from the institution. I mean, I really do not get it. So all this started uh, just because Atiku, you know, requested Tinibu's um, Chicago State University uh, certificate. So this is what is going on. But however, let us hear from uh, Frank Shaibu. Uh, if truly Atiku Awaka did not graduate from that institution during an interview with Shewun. Uh, on channels television. S-A-D-I-Q, Abubaka, not Siddiq as contained in the white certificate. Mm. Is it the same person as Asiku Abubaka? It's the same person as Asiku Okay. Oh. At the ABU diploma he got in hygiene that he, he, he got, is the name beard Atiku Abubaka. Yes, because he had done his change of name. At what point did he get the affidavit? At what point did he get the diploma in ABU? The, the, in the, so uh, we're looking at, at what point? Point? Just, no, look at just, this just now. Look ask, at the date. I'm the one asking you the yes, question, Frank. So, <laughs> at what uh, point is the discrepancy or the misspelling of Siddiq and Siddiq? No, no. You see, misspellings usually occur even in schools and colleges. Don't forget that I'm a teacher and a school owner. I see this every day. Our parents who will come that look, I won't pick this certificate. I won't pick this testimonial because my son's name was misspelled. I write my Imran with I with I M M R A N instead of I M R A N. So why is it this way? Do you understand? Have you clearly looked at the affidavit? Of course, I have taken. Have a you look compared it? it that it is in fact carrying a wrong name in uh, Mr. Atikua Worker's biography? Is never mentioned that he had a change of name. Oh no. Have, yes. you, have you found out that yes. uh, uh, after a search at the Anger Ruskin University in Cambridge, yes. they said they don't have anybody as Atiku Abubakar? Has that come to your team? In what? In Anger Ruskin University? Yeah. How can, how can anybody say that? But from his letters, he can't even come to us because anybody who projects that will just want to deflect on the issues. We are staying on the issue. Their man is a forger. He forged this certificate. But the, the question is... Yes. We're staying on this. Nobody can get a lot of Nigerians. The university from question. Man. He did not just graduate from Frank, 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 We have his letters of admission. We have his certificate. We close in 30 seconds yes. on this because, uh, I mean, we're pressed for time. <laughs> the question, and finally, is yes. on the moral ground. Yes. That why, and many Nigerians have seen them ask, that why are we having candidates who questions about the identity are coming up, including your principal, who has pointed accusing finger against the president that they are now saying, you too. No.